Hello everyone. Welcome to this video. In the previous video, we talked about seller account and Amazon specified regions. Now in this video, we'll discuss about various marketplaces that forms those regions. As I explained earlier, that all the countries where Amazon is having its presence is considered as a marketplace. And this is list of the countries where Amazon has its marketplace. Each marketplace is given a unique marketplace ID and you will also find this ID in your Odoo when you will connect your seller account in Odoo. Almost in all of these countries, Amazon has its fulfillment centers across the country where they store seller stock and whenever an FB order comes in, they fulfill the order from that seller stock. But in couple of countries where Amazon doesn't have fulfillment centers, uh, the order is being fulfilled from the nearest country's warehouse. Being the seller, if you want to sell on multiple marketplaces and you want to store your product in multiple countries, then you will need to comply with that country's tax regulations like uh, wet uh, registration and all that in order to store your product in that countries. So this was all about Amazon part. Now let us understand how we manage these things in Odoo. Now once I have created my seller in Odoo and I want to load all the marketplaces that I have activated on my seller account, I need to go to Amazon module, configuration, settings. There I can see all the sellers that I have added. I select the seller. And I see an option to add more marketplace to integrate, which will take me to the page from where I can select all the marketplace that I want to add here. Here you also need to select the Amazon fulfillment program in case you are doing FBA. Now while you select this program, please be very careful because this selection will automate some of the configurations in Odoo. In the coming videos, we'll be discussing about all the programs and related automated configuration in detail. But for now, if you are not sure about the program selection, the proper program selection, then I would recommend to connect with ME Pro support team. So after selecting all these marketplaces, now we are also uh, 1.2 keep in mind. If you are not able to see any of the marketplace in the given list, then make sure that uh, this marketplace is already activated on your seller account because if in your seller central account the marketplace is not there i mean it is not activated then you won't be able to see in the list so after selecting marketplaces click on create marketplace button and all the marketplaces will be created here and you can see those on your dashboard you can also see all the list of the marketplace here in the configuration. These are the details that you can see in the marketplace. So that's all for this video. Thank you for watching.